Hey guys, welcome to another uh, Gas Mask Guys episode. And today, uh, we're going to go over the uh, MM1 just quickly. And I'm going to show you how to remove the inner eye lenses. Now, as you can see, on some issue gas masks, if they were properly issued, they would have an inner lens. Uh, you can kind of see the black outline from here. And as you can see from storage, it's been badly disfigured. It's a 1964 mask. Very good condition, I do have to say, for the mask of its age, though. So, yeah, let's go. There we go. Flashlight's activated. Let's see. Uh, you got your mask here. That's interesting. Actually, I'll have to do a video on that one. Look at the uh, exhale intake. Yeah, no. So, as you can see, this black rim here, that's a second lens. Now, these were issued to, one, stop defogging, and two, it could be used as an extra lens if the... Uh, so let's say this lens broke, inside would still protect and uh, keep the seal. So it's, it's quite interesting how that works. Um, the eyepiece itself is covered by a black rubber uh, insert or outsert. It depends on uh, what you want to call it. And that's how it uh, stays in place. So yeah, I'm going to just quickly, so what you're going to need to keep things as simple as possible, all you need is an effed up butter knife. Really messed up butter knife. Ones that have a little bit of a curve. This one doesn't, I don't think. But um. The main idea is, what we want to do is go inside here, take the knife, let's see if I can get this on film, just quickly. See where I'm placing it? You want to get it all up up there, then push in. Now I won't be able to do this with one hand, so I'm going to put down the camera, and I'm going to pull up the first lens for you. So um, I'm just going to pull it up. As you can see, and this is what I used to repair that uh, GP5 uh, eye lens, it was these. And uh, they can be reused quite often. Now, let's put this rubber seal back in place. But as you can see, this is how it, uh, what it looks like. Yeah, it's pretty cool. As you can see, there's still a lens. See, there's no more lens in there. The best way you can tell is that black rubber edge. And that's how you can tell your mask was actually issued. However, there are some masks that were issued and they didn't use these. They used the plastic inserts. I do not like the plastic inserts. I much prefer these over that. So I'm going to pull out the next one, and I'll just quickly show you. And second one's out. Uh, to put them back in, it's pretty simple. And uh, it is a bit tedious, but you get the hang of it. All you have to do is just plop it back in here. Uh, and that's that's about it. You just place it in there. Uh, you got to push it pretty hard. If you need help, you got your trusty old rusty butter knife here. That's useless for anything but gas masks. So yeah. Yeah, I'm going to quickly, uh, right after this, I'm going to do a video on the MM1s. Uh, regardless of if it will be, uh, I don't know if it will be uploaded on the same day as this video. That doesn't really matter, but hopefully it will be. Anyway, I'm going to cut the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, yeah, see you guys.